Hello and welcome back to Outlast. I think this is going to be the final episode, the conclusion of what has happened at Mount Massive Asylum. Right, so we need to find Billy in the main laboratory. So I'm assuming it would be near the end of door post. Yeah, near the beginning. Perhaps. Okay, I think there's some more doors that have just opened here. And it has now closed. There is definite sounds of Billy flying around in the uh, in the vicinity. And there is definite proof that he has been here. Look at this place, he's just destroyed it. I mean this 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 asylum was more than just asylum. This was a this was a terrible place. Well hello, there's a little hidden place back here. A hidden area where there might be some cans of beans. And maybe a battery. Wait a minute. That wasn't hidden at all. What's in the freezer? I can't open the freezer. Right, I'm assuming this is here because it's going to give me the idea of being able to do the loop back on myself if I'm being chased. Um, bathroom. Any batteries? No. No batteries. Morphogenic engine chamber. This way, I suppose. Go towards the noise. Ah! Oh, God. I pressed the wrong button. Keep behind me, he is as well. Shh. Hard ha! No, 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 no. Um, um. Hide in the bathroom. Hide in the bathroom. Don't hide in the bathroom then. Oh no, Billy! Billy, no, no, I'm hit. Ah! Why, Billy? Why did you do this? That didn't go too well at all, did it? Right, let's learn from that mistake. More of a jar, nick, 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 nick chamber. Let's go back this way, because I feel like it. It's a camera. Maybe I can use that one instead of this shitty one I've got. It's destroyed and broken. Right, obviously I need to get back through that door where he comes from, because that was, um, looked like the place to go. My headset's falling off. Ah, he runs at you! Ah! Bastard! Right, we're gonna... Loop. Loop! Just loop around here. Don't run in any bathrooms. Just go this way. Round the corner. Get to that room. Come on, Miles. You can just... Don't slip on the blood. No! Open the door fast! Don't do it like you... Casually trying to... Oh god, I swear to god. I swear to god, Billy. Woo! Spray me all toxic gases. Morphogenic. Chamber is that way. Let's just go this way, cause. Oh, that is that locked? Yeah, okay, I can't. I thought I could God damn my headset's like falling off. Another document. See, I'm just going to go on it. The gods and monsters. Okay. Like I said, you want to read it? Just pause the video. Anything back here before I proceed? Like batteries would be most helpful.
Oh my. Look at this thing. Do I need to document this? Yes, I do. It's a good thing I, uh... Wait, no, it's... I gotta go to notes. Linux machine. I feel the chain of the procedure of the molecules fade when I... So, not only enough to know how to destroy it, but Billy is the creator of it. Find him, kill him, end this. I don't somehow think it's gonna be this easy. I think I can take that down. Definitely gonna need this battery. Things are starting to look sincere. Not that they look sincere before. At any point, this is just... It's got worse. Wait. Another note. From his patient reports, he ought to be 23 years old. He looks at least 50 years of rough road. Panic scratched deep into what I can see. Ah, uh, pain scratched deep into what I can see. Killing you would be an act of kindness. Surely would. Wait, I can hear him again. Screw this, I'm going up here. I don't really want to stay down there any longer than I have to. But I'll pick up this battery. Oh, no. It's the other one locked. They're both locked. <sighs> okay, obviously I wasn't meant to go up. Who's that down there? This is not a freak show. You gotta pay. You gotta pay to see this. Are you gonna tell me anything important? No. <laughs> He's just looking at, sh looking at it in shock. So I can't really blame him to be honest, because this place is more than just what we imagined. Right. So this looks like it could be something to do with a computer. Maybe like some big cooling duct towers. With all the morthogenic liquid, I don't know. Something nasty in every way. Right, so we gotta go to bleep bleep blop blop on the computer and turn this all off. Wait, wait! How do I get in? Ah, there's a door. I didn't see the door. So, mark pen. And documents. As always, there's always some documents. Uh... Wait, okay. Am I going to do anything in this room? Clearly not. But there is a card leaning over to you, which I think is this turny turny wheel. Warning! Do not turn the valve. That is exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. That didn't sound good at all. Do I need to go back in here? Wait. Ah! Where is he? Where is he? Where's Bob behind me? Miles, please do not mess up now. You've already been dead. Or you've already been killed by this guy. Right, but it looks like we got some time. Um, 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 um. Yes, there seems to be a flashing light up there, so that is, I'm assuming, means I need to get up there. Yes! You won't get past that. Saving. It's always a good sign. It means I go in the right way. Don't stop running, Miles! Run! Run for your life! Where are these stairs going to end? Oh my word, they keep going. Oh crap, okay, he's getting close. I know it, I know it, I know it, I know it, I know it. Ah! Gah!
Ah, it's non-stop, Billy. Ah, no. <laughs> oh, that was such a stupid scream. Oh. I did just scream like a little girl there. You all saw it as well. Ah, oh, man, he was so close as well. Another document. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's just stupid scream, and I feel so stupid. That was literally. <coughs> and I got it on camera. But this seems to be flashing. Destroy it all! Right, okay, I need to go back downstairs to see him. Get the camera out ready. So technically, he shouldn't be able to chase me because I've turned off his power supply. I guess. Oh! I'm assuming that was supposed to happen. Go, Miles. Still got a document in this mine. Oh, Nelly. Oh, Biscuit. Oh, of all that's holy. Here. Warning. Document this. Oh. No, I'm trying to help you, Billy. I'm trying to help you. You've got to understand this. Assuming Billy has gone inside me, and not in a good way either. Yeah, you know, get out! I just need this document. I just need this last bit of evidence. I didn't see it there earlier. So that would have been useful, I guess, if I'd seen that earlier. Anyway, it is. Get the hell out of here, Miles. Oh, dear. After all you have been through, this is how it ends. Billy's giving me terrible indigestion as well. I know you got two fingers short. You can do this. You're almost there. You've got everything you need. You've got the video, you've got the documents. And you can't read, but someone else can. You just have to hand them over to someone else. Go any faster? No. Get through this door. Let's get through the service um, delivery entrance. And we can just be free. Whoa!
Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get for pinning miles up short. Whatever it's going on, I'm assuming is bad. Well, there we go. That's Outlast. Ten episodes of pure hell. You know what? I, at the beginning of this game, I actually did say I've, I have played it before. And I can... I knew what was going to happen throughout that game, um, really. But th there's so many jump scares that you forget about. And there's so much that goes on. You just kind of... The first time you play it, you just kind of go through the game and you forget it. So, I mean, there were some, there were some moments I knew it was going to make me scared. Uh, but there were some jump scares in there I completely forgot about. Uh, this... I mean, the reason I played this game again was because I think it is so good. It, it, it's it got great atmosphere. It's got a good storyline. Apart from the ending's a bit strange with the fact that it's kind of some sort of Billy the Ghost um, Project War Rider thing. It, and, and then basically you don't get out of the end, you die. It's kind of a letdown, I suppose. But I can only assume, because I know there is a uh, whistleblower DLC to this game, which I want to play. Uh, so I'm assuming that might um, might carry on from the end of this in some way. I have not played that, so I really want to. That is one other reason I played through this game as well, because I wanted to recap, and I thought it'd be a good way to uh, a good thing to play through this game, um, kind of get the storyline, and then jump into Whistleblower, the DLC for that for this game. And I think that'll make a good video as well. But I will say I'm going to give Outlast a, a, just a bit of a break. Because it just becomes too much, I find. And then too much of something makes it kind of bad. If you know what I'm trying to say. But no, definitely, if you've not played this game, if you've watched, if you've, if you've watched me play this game, it is still worth having a go yourself. Um, it is, it is, like I said, it's, I don't know what the price of it is now on Steam. It's probably about £10. I don't, I don't know. It, it might be, it might be less than that. It might be more. I can't remember. Um, I know the DLC was about £5 when I last looked. Which is, is quite cheap. And it is still a great game. It still looks good. It's intense. It's got those moments so you just, just don't wanna you just wanna put it down and, and it has made me scream like a little child several times is you have seen yourself. So anyway, like I said, if you want try this game, it's it is good if you like a good horror game. But uh Looks like I'm going to have to end this series here. It's been a good game. It's been a good playthrough. And I hope you've enjoyed Outlast as much as I have. But uh, as always, guys, take care of yourselves. And I'll see you next time. Oh, there it goes. Ready? Look at it. Jesus! Oh, they're exploding trees around here. That did actually just explode. You did all see that. It wasn't just me. Come back, my logs.